Hello and welcome to the Grand Line Review. My name is Liam and this is Waifu. Say hello to Waifu, Liam. Hello. Hi. It's me. Yes, hello again, wife. I did it. You did do it. did your intro. You did. I didn't ask you to, but you did it anyway. Are you ready to teach me some more about One Piece today? Yes, I am. Very good. I've got some characters that I want you to describe to me. And we will begin with this one. Ah. Wanda. Wanda the Wabbit. <laughs> All right. And what's Wanda the Wabbit's deal? Well, I mean, beyond those bazongas. And that amazing slouch hat. He's Stevie from, from Cool Land. <laughs> I'm also not entirely sure that's a slouch hat or if you know what a slouch hat is. I don't think I do know what a slouch hat is, but she's wearing one. Sometimes he's a protagonist. Sometimes he's an antagonist. And in what arc was he a protagonist? The most recent one. Which is called? Gubuchi. <laughs> I don't know why you think One Piece has such weird names. Fine, the hamburger <laughs> arc, Liam, the hamburger arc. It's like the Happy Meal arc. So she's one of the good guys, casually pleasant and friendly to everyone that she meets. And she's really quite embarrassing because to the rest of the Wabbit world, she's a bit of a nom- a nom- 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 <laughs> <laughs> She's... <laughs> She's an anom- She an anomaly. She's an anomaly. <laughs> ah, yes, Julie. It's Julie. She's really freaking normal. She's an anomaly. How so? How many wabbits do you know with bazongas? Her eyes are creepy. But very normal. Very normal. In fact, too normal. That's why she's dead now. No. Oh, shit. I'm so sorry. That's a spoiler. That is a I huge I am so spoiler. sorry. Spoilers, 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 spoilers. Yeah, the problem for Wanda is that she's a wabbit and wabbits can't say the letter R. You so know. she likes cowards. Yes. Wanda likes cowards. Yes. Does that mean that Wanda's name is actually uh, uh, Randa? Don't, no, don't say it. Randa the rabbit? <laughs> Rhonda. Rhonda. Rhonda the rabbit. Right. So her name is Wanda. W-H-O-N-D-A. <laughs> Yes. Bork. Bork. I mean, I no, no, no. Bork. As in Bjork? Yes, but kind of not. Ah. Sorry, was that his name? Yeah. He's a grandstanding Japanese businessman. What kind of breed of dog is Bork? You know Dachshunds? Dachshunds. Dachshund. Dachshund? Dackies? He's Dacky. a Dacky? No, he's a corkscrew. Then why did you ask me if I knew what a Dachshund was? Because it's sort of similar and I thought it would be easy to get into it that way, but you decided to <laughs> comment on my pronunciation of the word Dachshund. I only do that because people crucify me when I say Dachshund, so I now have to say Dachshund. How many times have you said Dachshund in videos? A fair few. He's a businessman. Yes. In what field? Um, Chicken livers. For what price? Too much for you to afford. How much is too much for me to afford? How much is Luffy worth? Shouldn't I be asking you that? Yes, you should. <laughs> What's Luffy's current bounty? Bounty, you say. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Cheeto Bill. We start with the corkscrew uh, wagger, and then we move further up and we come to uh, the treat holes. Mm, he comes from a long line of Cheetos. There's Cheeto Barbara, Cheeto Sami, Cheeto Samara, Cheeto Belinda. Can I ask what the, uh, the G is for? I mean, that's a belt buckle, dude. Not everything has significance here. You've played Super Mario. You know those uh, giant bullets? Those giant bullets that come out and they're like, Mah! and then if they hit you, you go, Dwoop! if you shoot Bork, that's what happens. He struggles with long nails. Yep. Like any newborn baby. He's a newborn baby. <laughs> yes. Oh, how old is Cheeto Bill? He's seven days or younger. One hand, Sam. You see how he's got all of these bandages on? Yep. Like any newborn baby, he does scratch himself a lot. Looks like he's taken his hand clean off. It's growing back. How? He's Cheeto Bill. That explains nothing. What that... is he? What is he? Not who is he. What is he? He's a cat man. <laughs> you see that hand? One hand, Sam's one hand. Mm-hmm. Mm. You know what they say about big hands? Great at writing. Who are these guys? Horse and tree. Horse is the one on the right and tree is the one on the left. Aww. What is his... <laughs> Stop eating me. What is his purpose in the story? Um, well, he accidentally, accidentally destroys a continent. Which continent? The continent. The continent? There's only one. That's why there are islands now. What's the deal with horse then, in particular? He used to be a horse, but he ate the tree tree fruit. You can see where I'm going with this. 
And how about tree? Used to be a tree, ate the horse horse fruit, but actually technically the unicorn fruit. And he wears a wolf. What? (laughs) (laughs) Because, let's face it, a horse shouldn't be a tree and a tree shouldn't be a horse. I mean... No, everyone is special and unique. Be you. Okay, and what if tree was a horse and horse was a tree? What? Well, in that case, we are now moving on to my favourite part, which is where I get to tell you everything that you got wrong and a little bit that you got right. There are, there are some bits. I, I got it all right. Got it all right. Well, let's put that to the test. Let's get out the older marking pen. No, uh, no, no, I hate red pens. Put it away. Okay, I'll use a green pen. Wanda, the wabbit. Her name is Carrot. Carrot. And she is a mink. <laughs> yeah, she is. Mink, not a minx. Oh, right. Mr. Stevie. Stevie, yep. I feel like this is the person you were most wrong about. What? Like, this is Marine Admiral Kizaru, and he has the ability to become a light. Become a light. Like, um, the minks all have access to an ability called Electro, where they can, like, generate electricity. So I was, no. Yes. She's not a Duracell bunny. That sounds horrible. It sounds awesome. No. Did it, can, wait, can he travel at light speed? Yes. Oh. Is that how he got there? How he got there was he fired a cannonball from his ship, then he travelled onto the cannonball, and he rode the cannonball down to the island. I feel like he's overdoing it. Julie. Correct. (laughs) Took you a while to remember, but this is Julie, apparently the most normal Normal. person in the One Piece world. Yes. I wouldn't say that. This is Monet. I would be embarrassed if I painted lilies and someone said, I'm going to name a bird woman after them. I don't see why. You would be embarrassed. (laughs) Cut that. <laughs> no. <laughs> Cut that. Pork. Yes, you keep saying pork. No, I'm not. <laughs> it's a plosive B. Pork. Pork. No, no, no. Pork. 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 The dog's name is Lasso. Ugh, they just, there's no, there's no creativity here. And you were almost right. Lasso is a dachshund. I mean, I was completely correct. Here's something you were very right about. Yes. She's dead. Huh. And that is a very rare thing in the One Piece world. So you were actually very right about that. I'm very right. She had her heart stabbed by a mad scientist clown. That's really specific. She had her heart stabbed. She was stabbed in the heart or she had her heart stabbed? She had her heart stabbed. Very conveniently or inconveniently, her heart and her were in different rooms when it happened. You are not allowed to tell me that anything I make up is stupid. This one's tricky because Lasso began life as As a a gun. I was right. He shoots. He does shoot. He shoots explosive baseballs. I want to insert treats into his treat hole. (laughs) Paw. This is loud G. Oh, does he ever close his mouth? He does close his mouth. But then he's quiet G. (laughs) This is Nekomamushi. He's a kitty. Yes, he's a cat. You recognize the word Neko, don't you? Yes. What does Mamushi mean? Viper, so he literally translates as cat viper. Cat snake. Is oh. that why he only has one hand? Is the other one secretly a snake? Now you see, that's kind of a sad story. His oh. island was invaded by a man who can become a mammoth. In fact, the whole island was an elephant. Surely you remember this one. He's one hand man. Oh my God. <laughs> Damn, it was like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> then why do I remember? Is <laughs> you have a functioning brain. Thank you. <laughs> Now that I have that on the record. I'm doing a PhD. (laughs) Yes, you are. This is uh, what you called him, One Hand Sam. One Hand Sam. I knew it rhymed with man somehow. This is Silver's Ray Lee. That doesn't sound right. He's severed it. And he's growing it back. He's not growing it back, sadly. Well, I know. He's growing it back happily. (laughs) (laughs) So these two are probably best known as... Horse and Tree. You're very close. Zombie tree and zombie unicorn. I'm leaving. However, they do have real names. Please, please just put put in put in some footsteps and a door sh- shutting. I'm leaving. I'm gone. The zombie uni- <laughs> The zombie unicorn's name is Unigaro, and the zombie tree's name is Mock Donald. I'm, 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 <laughs> Well, this has been a fruitful endeavor. Thank you very much, wife. Delicious bottom fruit. All right, you go and have some delicious bottom fruit. I'll I'll go and edit this. I guess maybe. The, wait. I feel like it. At the end of every single one of these videos, we've discussed the fact that you're going to provide dinner for me. I'm not providing dinner for you now. It's eight sixteen p.m. No, I'm hungry though. 
Well, we were supposed to go food shopping. Well, we can go food shopping now. Oh, okay. We're going food shopping. Yeah, okay. Okay, bye. Bye. Yay!